Hello again. It's Miss Iron Sin. What's up, guys? Um, today I am doing for you this hairstyle, my faux ponytail, my phony tail, if you will, with a suicide roll that you can barely see because I don't know what's happening with the lighting in my house. I have both windows open, a ring light in front of me, and my ceiling light on. So I don't know. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really trying. Someone help. Anyhow. So, I am trying to get some angles for you to see. This is my favorite quick, um, if I could stop saying um, that'd be great, but I can't, I don't know why. This is my favorite quick hairstyle to do when we are leaving at like 6 a.m. for a car show and I would rather spend all the time on my face, honestly. So it's my go-to, one of them. I like fake hair, obviously. So if you are a fake hair connoisseur like me, then this might be awesome for you. If not, and you have fantastic hair, good on ya. Uh, go ahead and just curl your own ponytail and ignore that part of this video. My suicide roll came out a little smaller than I would have hoped for, but it'll do. So, with that said, let's get into it. Today, our weapons of choice are paddle brush, teasing brush, duckbill clips, curling iron, Tresemme four hold hairspray, your favorite pomade, mine is American pomade. I will be showing you how I put in my VP Fashion ponytail extension. I already pre-curled it last night, so I didn't have to do it today. We have somewhere to go, so I'm trying to do this fast. And then you can use anything you want, a hair ribbon or a flower. Today I'll be using this bow that I made. I just put it on an alligator clip. So let's get started. I already went ahead and created my part and we're gonna do this just like we did our victory rolls. So I'm gonna do the one big suicide roll with ponytail, as you're gonna see in my intro. So I don't need to tell you that. All right, so we're gonna take this down to the ear, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna decide how big we want our roll. We're not doing a whole uh, whole victory roll, so we're not using all of this. I'm going to come in and cut it about here. So it's just a big square. So this is my section. And then, yeah. That'll be good. All right, so I do want to make sure that it's more of a square. So I'm going to add a little bit to it.
I lied. So there's my section. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna pin all of this back with one of our duckbill clips. Get all that hair out of my mouth. Maybe two duckbill clips. And now we're gonna make a ponytail. So if you don't need a ponytail extension like I do, I just prefer it. It's really, you think you don't need it and then you buy one and you're like, oh my God, my ponytail is so beautiful now. <laughs> so I just prefer it like big and full and long. So if you don't need that, you have great hair, um, you can go ahead and just put your hair up in a ponytail, curl the ends, and you're good to go. However, if you are here to see how I put this in, then you can watch and not skip forward. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and make a very smooth ponytail. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in with a little bit of pomade and smooth out my ponytail, take it out, and then um, brush it with my teasing brush just to really smooth it and make sure I have a really slick pony. Especially underneath where I have all these baby hairs. So I'm just taking like in my last video, the back of my nail into the pomade and then putting it on my hands, warming it up and then putting it in my hair. Okay, so now I'm gonna take this out and I'm gonna smooth it because I don't want a lumpy pony. and do a little hairspray. And now we're gonna work on that roll. You hear my crazy dog barking in the background? I don't know what is happening right there. I'm actually gonna take this back out and redo it right here. It needs to be brushed a little bit. All right. There you go. Okay, so now we are going to curl this roll just like we do our victory roll. So we're gonna take sections and spray them. Drop it into your hand. Come in. There we go. And pin it. Boom. All right. So, give it a nice little spritz. 
Now, while that cools, we're going to do our ponytail. I'm gonna uh, leave that on actually, because we'll need that later. So here is my ponytail. It came with this cute little hanger. I'm going to take it off the hanger. Now, it has this little comb and then it has Velcro. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that little comb and we're gonna sink it in to the base of the ponytail. And I'm gonna pull out the little extra wraparound part. Actually, I wanna pomade it because I wanna make sure it's smooth. So I'm gonna put a little pomade on my fingers and just smooth this extra piece because it wraps around your ponytail so you can't see the extension. Okay, there we go. So now we're gonna take that comb and sink it in. I don't know if you can see because my hair is so dark but you put it over your ponytail sink it in tuck in the one side and then wrap the velcro around and wrap this extra piece around the base Oh, I forgot to tell you that we need bobby pins for this hairstyle as well. I'm sure that's a given, but what am I doing? So now take a bobby pin and sink it into there so that end stays. And then I'm just gonna take my natural hair and make sure it's covered. So when you flip your hair around, you won't see it. Take my brush, brush it out. There we go. super quick super simple and beautiful all right so we're gonna take out these guys now and give them a nice good tease So just like you do with your victory rolls, all, almost all the way to the end, about three quarters of the way, till it stands up on its own and looks real nice and crazy. Okay, so now we're going to do, here's the thing, <laughs> I should have don't do this before my hair looks like this. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to roll this suicide roll towards your face and in so that the roll is right here instead of rolling it backwards for a victory roll. So all your tease is going to be in the front because the outside is the part you want smooth this time, if that makes sense. So to put them together so that you don't have all those lines, I'm going to back comb the front this time. Okay, so this is what we look like. And brush out the ends now. Give it a nice little spritz of hairspray. I 
I haven't done this look since I've put my streak in, so I'm really excited to see how it turns out. We'll see if we can even see it. <laughs> so, pomade. So we have this crazy wave here and you can put your hand underneath it to hold it and make sure you don't lose all your shape and then use the side of your teasing brush to smooth the outside just like with the victory roll and you're going to want to smooth the front a little bit too just where you're going to see it. So roll up those ends so those are nice. Let's see what we got. Let's try to roll it up and see what happens. So you're going to roll so that the roll's in the front. I'm just gonna see what's happening here. <laughs> What needs to be fixed? So this is pretty crazy, so I'm going to smooth this a little bit. I just don't want to smooth it too much so that all the T's comes out and then my rolls not big enough. Hairspray, so it's easier to pin it. I would have liked it bigger than this, but it is what it is. So if you want a bigger roll or a smaller roll, just take more hair. You know, if you want a bigger roll, take more hair. If you want a smaller little tiny roll, then just take less hair. I'm going to wipe the pomade off my hands and then we're going to bobby pin it in place. And you want to make sure you cover the side so it doesn't look all gross from the side. Okay. Got some crazy hairs going on back here. So we're going to tuck those in and anchor it from the back.
kind of pin it underneath to kind of hold it down and then just make sure that I've covered that bobby pin you don't want to see it Gonna do our little curling iron trick that I showed you in the last video. Gonna go back to smoothing. I just want the outside of this roll really nice and smooth. I'm trying to get this little hair right here. Pretty quick hairstyle. I'm gonna put my little bow in here, which you won't be able to see because it's black too. So, <laughs> sorry guys. I think I did this video too early. I don't have enough natural light. So there's my little bow. But you could also put like a flower here to kind of hide the outside of it if you wanted to. I've seen people do that. Or you can put a flower back here or tie a ribbon for a bow is really cute. Or a um, hair scarf, I've seen people do that. It's just kind of whatever you like, whatever you prefer, you know? Find these hairstyles and then make it your own. Turn it into, you know, your style and what you like. All right guys, so, that is my quick and easy faux ponytail suicide roll hairstyle. Anyways, so do all the things that YouTubers tell you to do. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, I will link down below my hair ponytail extension. You don't have to buy this one. You can literally buy any ponytail extension that looks the same and I'm sure it'll be great. As long as it's uh, real human hair. 
that way you can curl it straighten it do whatever you want to it and uh it won't melt on you <laughs> so yeah um i'll link it down below i'll link american pomade if you want to pick up some pomade they are having a sale right now so check that out and i will link my social media in case you want to follow me check out my outfit that you can't see that i'll post photos of later today um yeah so thanks for making it this far checking it out watching the video um thanks for being here i really appreciate you guys and I hope you have a great day.